Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. The Rudd government is determined to duplicate how the Howard government breached the international law under the Solace Convention of 1954. The international distress call came from a sinking vessel with many passengers aboard in the Indian Ocean, somewhere south of the Indonesian island of Java. The Mayday was relayed to the Australian Maritime Safety Authority. OSA, the search and rescue arm of AMSA, responded to the call and mobilised resources. The vessel was subsequently found and the nearest ship, the Norway registered container vessel, the MV Tampa, advised on OSA that it could assist. And so on and so on. You remember the saga. This incident was effectively taken out of AMSA's control before they had completed their and their country's duty under Solace due to in political interference. At this point and when the Australian military boarded the Tampa and the subsequent delays caused to a vessel which did nothing more at the request of Australian SAR authorities comply with its obligations under Solace the Howard Government of Australia breached its international legal obligations. And so the Rudd Government intends to duplicate the breach of the Solace Convention of 1954 at every opportunity. Who would vote for these people? <laughs>